everyone so thank you so much for watching today i have a review on the lush naked american cream solid conditioner and this was in the kitchen a while ago and i did get this they had a bunch of different other naked products like deodorants and other hair care items and they featured this and one other conditioner which was the happy happy joy joy and it wasn't a solid but that was quite expensive so i thought you know i wanted to try this out i do love american cream and here we go i'm gonna let you know my results so the first time that I used it, I did use quite a lot of the product. Uh, I just have it in a bag here to keep it. And then when I used it the first time around, it had like a wax top that went about up here. And I peeled off the wax top and used all the product underneath. So it was about like that much product, about. And I pinched it off, rubbed it in my hands and skimmed it to, through my hair and uh, just rinsed it out like normal. And it felt nice in the shower. It did feel very nice through my hair, it made it feel smooth and silky. And then after I rinsed it out and got out of the shower and just air dried my hair like normal with a towel, I do not blow dry my hair. It left my hair feeling very matte. Uh, it was soft, it was like a soft matte feeling, but the texture of my hair being so matte left it very easily um <laughs> to tangle or so to speak it just it tangled very easily because it was so matte and i did not like that i was really upset uh, i just had high hopes for this product to work and it didn't it tangled my hair it did feel soft but it was just so matte and almost dry uh, I was really upset. I kind of put it down for a little bit and just said, I'm not going to use this again for a while. And then I thought to myself, you know what? I need to give it a second try. I, I spent my money on this, so I should try to <laughs> try to make it work a little bit. So the way that I used this the second time around was I rubbed it in my hands. I did not pinch off any product. This time I just rubbed it in my hands to get like a nice thick coating. I feel like I used an appropriate amount. I wouldn't say I used, um, you know, more than I used the last time. So I did use less and I did use a nice good layer on my hands and just skimmed it through as normal. Again, performed the same way as it did in the shower. Felt very nice and soft. But then when I got out and dried my hair, it still left me with that very, very matte, almost dry feeling on my hair. Um, it did feel like, like a soft matte texture. I can't explain it any other way. And it did, again, tangle very very easily and um overall i was just I'm, I'm very disappointed with it and i even emailed blush and let them know that the product didn't work for me and that i didn't like it and then they messaged me back just saying well you can refund we can refund you if you mail the pro the rest of the product to us and honestly i would have had to pay for shipping for it to go back to uk and and i would have gotten my refund and it just didn't seem worth it to me so I am going to keep this product and I'm going to use this product and try to salvage it. But the way that I'm going to use this product now is to combine it, and I have made a video about this previously, with the liquid version of this, I did combine it with the VO5 Moisture Milk Strawberry Conditioner and it did work very, very well on my hair. So I'm thinking this combined with that product, it'll work as well, but I, I just, I feel like for what you're trying to do with this and what you're paying for it, it's it's just not worth it. Like I get what they're trying to do. You're trying to make this as a naked version and to use less bottled products. But if I have to use a bottled conditioner with this, it loses its purpose, so to speak. And I just feel like I essentially wasted my money. But uh, the scent of this is great. It does last very long on the hair until you wash it again this scent will stay on your hair, which is one of the redeemable aspects of this conditioner. Um, but for me to have to double condition, it's, it's not, it's not worth the hype. It's really not worth, worth your money. Um, but if you were like me and bought this product, 
I'd say the best way to salvage it and to still use it is to combine it again with the VO5 Moisture Milk Strawberry Scented Conditioner. What I do with it is, is I just use that first and then I would probably use another layer of this over top of it and just rinse it out and then you are left with this scent and the strawberry scent in that does combine nicely with this. So that's my best recommendation for this product and I, honestly, I, I really wanted this to work. I, I really wanted to love it. I do love the scent. It smells amazing. So I still will continue to use this product, but it's just so much. And for, for what I paid for, I got what I got. So the the only way I'm going to salvage it is to combine it with my VO5 Moisture Milk Strawberry Scented Conditioner. So that's my best recommendation for this. Honestly, I, I really wish I would have liked this product more than I did. I wish it would have worked better than I would have thought. I had a lot of high hopes for this and it just, it let me down. I, I feel like the Happy Happy Joy Joy conditioner might have worked better than this. But again, it was very expensive and I just, I couldn't, I couldn't justify making that purchase because it was so much money. But I bought this and yeah. That is my honest review. <laughs> I hope you found this helpful. Uh, don't get this conditioner. The liquid version is much, much better. But if you did get this conditioner, I'd say the best way to salvage it, if it didn't work well for your hair, is to give it to somebody who you know works well on their hair. Gift it, you know, gift it, you know. <laughs> but uh, just, just try it with that conditioner. I, I recommend it. I think this is probably the best way that you can still use this product. And yeah. <laughs> so that's it that's all I've really got to say thank you so much for watching again I hope you found this review helpful just let me know what you think did this work well for you you know if it didn't uh, let me know how you're gonna try to salvage it I guess and yeah thank you for watching and I'll see you another one bye